Hello everyone, it's Steamboy27. I skipped back to Garai's home because you can easily get there by yourself. If you want to purify things, we have to talk to Mabu. Don't overdo it until you get better at hunting, alright? Try talking with Mother Garai if there's something you don't understand. I'm pretty sure we get everything now. But I'd watch out. Her stories can be long and boring. But don't tell her I said that. I don't that. know if I want her to tell us those stories then. Our enemy we love, and for the tormented we pray. Grant us, the beasts of knowledge, the power to touch the spirit. Uh, I'll probably be skipping the dialogue every time this happens from now on, though. It's only cool once, you know? Alright, cool. And by doing that magic, by the way, she heals us. So let's equip Potamiel. Well, good luck! I'll always be here if you need anything. Well, let's see if Mother Gry actually has a story for us. Maybe she, it's actually interesting. Ever since your father disappeared into the forest, Chorus has been taking very good care of Cyrus. Until maybe yesterday. However, he promised to do so only until you came of age. Oh, what a cruddy time that is. I think it would be best for you to study under him. Uh, she doesn't actually have any stories. Okay, cool. Well, no, you know we're just gonna skip that dialogue. Okay, we're just gonna we're just gonna skip that. I don't know if we can use the blacksmith right now. I think maybe we can, and I might want to. Hey, dude. I don't have anything good for you yet, but you can buy what I've already made. Sounds good. Let's buy something. Bronze sword. Fairly heavy, but it's made of bronze. There's our dagger over there. And we got a chainmail vest. Sometimes we have to sacrifice things for speed. Ooh, a leather headband. I'm gonna buy that leather headband. Oh, I said ask me if I want to equip it now, but I should have done that. Let's sell our old knife because I don't feel like we're gonna need to use that later. And let's go. If you need a more powerful weapon, come back later. Maybe I'll have something ready by then. By the way, weapons aren't that important in this game, but it's really the only thing you're gonna buy with your money. Let's put that headband. There we go. In this game, there's an actually a cool balance between speed and power. I, I like it very much. Alright, let's go to the Beetle Forest. With our new bug. A bug familiar. Summoning in this game takes the summoning and using your uh, monster, your minion, takes up one turn, so you don't have to worry about sending out a new kind of uh, minion. Every time you enter and leave the gate, new things will show up. Sometimes things will not be there, sometimes things will be there. Oh, look, uh, a thing. Knowledge 1 picked up. There are some really subtle treasures in this game. Some of them are really hard to find, like this one. Let's go look in our valuables, because that's what it is. And yeah, there's the Flute of Capture, the Tears of Reese, Beetle Key, and Knowledge 1. This is just the uh, rule of elements that uh, Chorus told us earlier. But we have in our inventory now to see if we need it and to remind us every now and then. There's a save point for us, and a suspicious looking thing that we cannot use. Way to go. Let's go this way. Oh, we can't go this way. Okay. Aha! This is a paddle chew. Let's fight it. Eh. I'm, I'm probably gonna capture it. We don't need Patalmio. We can name these guys, but I really don't feel like naming them. I feel like their names are already eloquent enough. One more hit and we should be able to capture him. Oh, what the? Ah, uh, this guy has a special ability. We'll be able to see what that ability is later.
By the way, viewers, you want to balance between capturing monsters and killing monsters with your minions. Either that or you're just going to have to go grinding. Because with these cocoons that you get, you can either spin them into silk, or you can keep them as monsters. And spinning them into silk is the only way you can make money in this game. So you have to decide between experience or money. There's no in-between. I keep doing that because I keep pressing a circle. Ah, right here is another item. I bet you can barely see it. We got some shab liquor. In a pouch. I don't know how that works, but oh well. Oh, another paddle chew. Let's fight this guy with our minion. First, let's weaken him by ourselves because our monster isn't as good by on its own right now. Hopefully he won't use his red glowing horn attack. Oh, he did it. Oh, man. Maybe I should defend. Anyway, let's call him Potomio. Alright, so now we have a new menu. We can do special attacks, magic attacks, Attack or defend. We can also switch back to ourselves if we want to. Our our buddy has a uh, Agni, a fire attack, and it does extra damage versus air monsters or air minions. I gotta get used to that. Higher fire element ratio yields more damage. So the more pure fire your monster is, the more damage that does. So let's try using Agni. It uses up 10 MP, but I think it's worth it. We got some shab lurker during that fight, and Potomio leveled up. Look at that. Cool. Let's go into here. Whoa! I just ran into that guy. A Mukambu. Mukambu is a water type, so we don't really want to have our have our hornet attack this one. Okay, how much damage did I just do? Uh, let's see. 25 minus 7 is 18. We just did 9 to it. Um, okay, maybe I'll have Potomio try and hit it once so we can weaken it. I really hope it doesn't kill it, though. Oh, he's defending. Good. I'm glad he's defending. Now we can capture it. Sweet. Even though a minion's defending, it doesn't reduce the chances of it uh, being able to uh, get captured. Oh, that's right, Mukambus have a, a special ability to heal themselves. Let's try... There we go, good. Hopefully he won't do that again. Let's try and capture it. Fantastic. Alright, so we have two fireflies, and we've captured three all together. Alright, so we can kill this one. Oh, but he's running away. You won't get away. We're gonna take you, and uh, we're gonna, we're gonna make you experience. Oh my god, what's up all these guys getting criticals? Alright, now we cannot use Agni on this guy because there are only two types of damage in this game. Uh, super effective or resistant. Everything else is normal. So you have to defeat this guy the... the you have to defeat this guy the, uh, the hard way. Unfortunately, that means exposing ourselves. Oh, that's not fair at all. By the way, you saw how we have our... We have all our mana back. That's because in this game, you get 10 mana back per monster per battle. It's actually kind of cool. And I think they also get some HP back too. This is why they uh, they empathize 
that you need to use your uh, familiars to fight. Did I say familiars? I meant to say minions. I'm getting all these games mixed up together. Oh, and I'm also partially wrong. Summoning just takes less uh, time than it does to attack or defend, so you have a chance of getting a second turn. Anyway, there we go. Ooh, the Mirror of Diva. This is a usable item. Come on. There we go. It's a usable item. It reflects all unclean elements and protects against all abnormal states. It's pretty good, but it will break in the process. So it's a it's a barrier of sorts. I think it's like safeguard. Ooh, a treasure chest. Ah, but it's locked. We need a key to open it. Hey, come here, you. Come back. I get the feeling all these guys are going to be using uh, heal on themselves when they need to. Yep, that's what I thought. That's okay. Bam! I don't think I'll kill it with the next strike. No, I, I definitely won't now. Actually, how much damage does uh, Agni do, anyway? I wanna see. Yeah, it doesn't do a lot at all, okay. Oh man, come on! Well, let's switch back. I love how we can do a backflip, that's just really flick- that's really kinda cool. Uh, I, I, can, I love seeing that, that backflip. Anyway. Alright, let's finish- oh, never mind, he gets to defend. Let's finish him off. He can't have any more mana, so it's gonna be fine. There we go. Alright, and Patamio leveled up again! Fantastic. Doesn't seem like there's anything here. Oh, but there's a way to outside, but there was another route we didn't take. Oh look, we're uh, we're cut off. This is where we needed to go earlier. And there's actually no items behind this door. This is a dead end. So we have to remember though that there's a treasure chest in here. I wonder why Chorus hasn't opened that one yet. Maybe it's there because he left it- Oh! Hey, buddy! You know, I'll let Patamiel take care of this one, because he can heal after every battle. I can't. A lot of damage. In this game, you're penalized for having too many elements on one monster. Oh, wow, we blocked it. In this case, in the game, I like to only I like to only merge monsters of the same element and keep it very focused, and it pays off in the long run. At least in my opinion. Let's keep on going. Ooh, another thing on the ground. See that? Knowledge, too. And before this guy walks into us, let's read it. Higher attack and mana values result in more effective normal, special, and ma magic attacks. The higher your speed, the more turns you receive to attack your enemy. Well, with that piece of useless knowledge, I think we'll s Actually, no. Let's fight this dude right here. Critical hit.
Oh, that one hit. There we go. Alright, cool. I think we'll leave it off here. This is Steamboy27, wishing you all a brighter tomorrow. Have a good day.